Dude, yeah. I was taking this Nintendo survey yesterday. I don't know if you follow oh, I love those. this social media extravaganza. I uh, I took it and I was like, I'll give them my feedback. I'll be helpful and I'll tell them, you know, what I think about their situation. But seriously, like the first question is like, you know, which of these social media services do you follow us on? Twitter, Vine, you know, Reddit, Tumblr, Facebook, Bebo, MySpace. Anyway, I said no to all of them but Twitter. And then it proceeded okay. to ask me why I didn't follow them on every single social media platform. There's like 50 of them. I was like, I don't use Tumblr. I don't use Facebook that much. I don't use like all this shit. And then eventually we get to the hard hitting questions. It throws out shit like, seriously, this is a, a survey from Nintendo for consumer feedback. Here's a question. Who would win okay. in a fight, Mario and Luigi or Jimmy Kimmel and Jimmy Fallon? And I, at that point, I closed the browser and I turned off your computer. I turned off my computer and I went for a went long walk apartment. outside. Yeah. I I took half a fucking hour filling out this survey to do some to give them some feedback about YouTube. And if you try to like type nothing, <laughs> it just goes, you gotta fill that out, motherfucker. And I'm like, oh unacceptable. Okay. Well you can't you can't leave yet. You leave this is over when I say it's over. That wasn't even the last question. There were like apparently like four or five more pages after that. And then they get into some shit. Okay, first off, who would win in a fight between Mario and Luigi and Jimmy Kimmel and Jimmy Fallon? And then they're like, okay, what's your salary? You know, because we want to know oh. how people in the under 20,000 bracket feel about Jimmy Kimmel uh, and Jimmy Fallon versus Mario and Luigi. Then people in the, you know, 40,000 to 60,000 bracket. And then people in the over 120,000 bracket. We want to, we, we seem to find that people in the over 120,000 bracket seem to, uh, well, they seem to f say fuck off to this survey because they've apparently got more important things to do if they're making that kind of money, probably. And uh, they seem to think that the real people have more of a chance against the uh, the fictional characters, whereas people in the uh, under twenty thousand category they seem to believe in the the mysticism of you know wizards who can shoot fireballs out of their hands. And it's just like, what the fuck are you even? What does this survey mean? You know, we've we've found that people between the ages of uh, eighteen and thirty five prefer Mario and Luigi in a fight to Jimmy Fallon and Jimmy Kimmel. And then he's like, well, set it up, motherfuckers! Pay-per-view! You're missing the real story here, you know. What is they're, the real story here? They're unintentionally and accidentally announcing new Smash Brothers DLC. <laughs> oh, fuck. That would be so good. <laughs> if it went from Mercedes <laughs> in uh, Mario Kart to Jimmy Kimmel and Jimmy Fallon in <laughs> Smash Bros. Oh, I wouldn't even be mad. That's the one way you get Northern Lions forgiveness, Nintendo. Here's your opportunity. Dude, I I probably would have voted for Jimmy Kimmel and Jimmy Fallon because they're real human beings. If they got teleported into the Mario world, yo, that's that's the Mario Mario Brothers domain. They can shoot fireballs out of their hands, fly through the sky. I uh, I would probably bet on the Mario Brothers. However, put them in Smash Bros. Let's settle it. Wouldn't it also have been better if they just went for just like a stupid pun or wordplay and were just like, hey, Mario versus Mario Batali. Like that at least you'd go, hey. And right. then, you know, just there'd be there'd be three options. Mario Mario, Mario Batali, and who the fuck is Mario Batali? <laughs> <laughs> Wrong age group. <laughs> <laughs> we found that uh, you know, thirty-five to fifty-two year old housewives who watch the Food Network really feel like Mario Batali could probably beat up uh <laughs> Mario Mario. Or at least cook a right. damn fine pescatore while doing so. Go do the survey right now, see if I'm lying. You should put your age as like under 13, and then your salary is over $120,000. <laughs> <laughs> and then say the Jimmys would win in a fight. Watch someone's head explode over at Nintendo HQ. <laughs> what would that release like? They would have some kind of an answer to that, and they'd have to change their fall lineup for 2016 or something. They, we like, Jimmy Fallon's investment banking portfolio manager for Wii U. We need to make the, the music's greatest mysteries YouTube video. Archie's Weird Musical Mysteries, starring Jimmy Fallon and Mario Batali. That would be an interview I would so watch! I bet they'd cook something delicious and they'd have a fun time doing it, Nick. I bet they would. I bet they'd have a fun I time. I bet they would both leave that on. interview with a smile on their faces.